Hey guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. So today I will take you with me through my day. Uh, we're still in quarantine. I'm in quarantine for, um, I think, nine weeks now because I became really sick in the beginning of Corona. And to be honest, I don't know if I had it or didn't had it and it was just a flu, but that's not important. I'm still inside and sometimes Michal and I go for a walk but that's the only thing we do. I woke up an hour ago, um, it was eight o'clock in the morning, and then I took a shower, I washed my hair. I don't wash my hair often because it's not healthy for your hair. I only wash it every five or six days and always use dry shampoo. But now it's time to have breakfast and after that I will do my skincare routine and show it to you guys. I will go downstairs because my freezer is downstairs and I need to have some frozen berries. And I will drink a smoothie for breakfast today so I will show you how I make my smoothie. Smoothie. It's time for my morning skin routine. I will show you what products I use daily and these are not expensive, so that's really nice. I always start to wash my face with cold water and I use a makeup remover for my eyes from The Ordinary. Yeah. After that, I will use the Marine Hyaluronics. This one. Oh, I hope you guys can see it. So after that one, I use the Natural Moisturizing Factors Plus HA by The Ordinary 2. Um, the products from The Ordinary are super cheap. So I think all these products are, I think, 6 euros per product. So I use this one after that one because this one is a little bit sticky. I don't use much product, just this. The last product I use... It's the Skin Trainer Eyes from Kiko Milano. It's this one. This helps against blue circles and thickness. These are the products I use for my skin daily. Um, I also use these products before bed, so I use it twice a day. Now it's time to clean my house because Vika and I always make a mess in the evening, so I will vacuum the living room i think i need to vacuum every room um clean the furniture and i also need to do some laundry so that's what i'm going to do first and after that it's time to work out
I'm done with my workout. Now it's time to shower, eat. I'm super hungry. And after that, I will do my makeup. It's time for lunch, but I need to wait because I'm a little bit weird. I don't like to eat my omelette warm. I only like it cold, so I need to wait till it's cold. Um, so I added 15 grams of cheese and two slices chicken. Okay, guys, before we start, I'm not a professional. I just like makeup and I really don't know what I do, but it works. I will show you what kind of products I use and what color tones and um, yeah, let's do this. First, I don't use foundation at the moment because I don't need it now. I'm not going outside. So I only need some concealer. The concealer I use is from Catrice Cosmetics. Uh, it's a liquid camouflage high coverage concealer in the color. Is there a color? Oh yeah. 005 Light Natural. Um, so I will use a little bit on my chin on my nose and on my forehead. I always use a beauty blender. I can do my makeup without a beauty blender. I'm using self tanner at the moment. So that's the reason why this concealer is a little bit light. For the people who wanna know what self tanner I use, I use uh, Loving Tan in the color uh, Dark Brown. And it is really nice, it smells really good, but it comes off really, really quick when you're sweating. So that's the thing I don't like about it. Then I will use my, oh my God, Cheek Leaders by Benefit. Uh, I always use the color Hula, that's this one. And I always use this one for blush. So I have a really big brush. Where's my... And I just do this. I start in my neck. To my chin. To my cheeks. Forehead. Okay, then I will use my blush brush. This is uh, the self tanning brush from Mark and Bain. I used to use Mark and Bain self tanning, which is really good. But the reason why I started with Loving Tan is just because I wanted to try something different. But I think after this bottle from uh, Loving Tan, I will start with Mark and Bain again. But I don't know why I say all of this. I just use this brush for my blush <laughs> I forgot my highlighter downstairs all my makeup is downstairs in the garage where also my clothes are I will give you a room tour next vlog what's next I use the uh, Tartlette Tartlette in blue Tartlette in blue Tartlette <laughs> Okay, I usually use the color Sweetheart or Smarty Pants. I have really blue circles under my eyes in the morning. Sometimes this is just like dark blue. So I find out that I can use eyeshadow under my eyes and it really helps. I use the color Charmer and Flower Child. These two and it's um, so nice. But my brush is also downstairs, of course. But I will try it like this, and otherwise I will get it. Okay, this will not work. Okay, brush and highlighter. 
<sighs> These brushes are the ones from AliExpress and I ordered them three years ago and they are still good. I have this brush for the lower eyeshadow. I use the charmer under my eyes. But maybe you can you see the difference? I don't know. Shit. Next, eyeshadow above my eyes, where it belongs. I usually use brown for my eyeshadow. Also, I don't know how to do this, so I just do it like this. It always works. You may ask yourself, where's Michal? Because he's not home and because of the coronavirus time, but he has his own private office because he's a web designer. So he's working there alone. I just did my eyeshadow. The camera is so far away. It's just a little bit browner. Eyebrows. Don't do something special. Just brush them with eyebrow gel. The eyebrow gel I use is from Benefit. It's the 24 hour brow setter. I just brush my eyebrows up. Yeah. Next, highlighter. This is the absolute best highlighter in the world. It's uh, Anastasia Beverly Hills Amrezy and Amrezy stopped selling these. I don't know why, because it's the best highlighter ever and it sold out really quick. Next, the Tarte Mascara. It's a vegan one. It's called Gifted. I already bought this one four times in a row, so that's how much I love. That's it. Thanks for watching my makeup routine. I hope you guys liked it. Now it's time for me to work. And for some of you guys, you may ask yourself, what kind of work does she actually do? So the work I do is I usually work as a personal trainer for 10 hours a week. And besides that, I work full time as uh, an influencer or on social media and normally as a fitness model. So because of the virus, I don't work as a personal trainer at the moment because it's not like it normally is. I stopped doing that and after the corona, situation i will start again of course as i just told you i work as an influencer fitness model um, on social media the things i do is i always like to help people with questions about products gymshark products pe science products or just regular fitness questions uh, i create content so i record videos i take pictures sometimes miko helps me with um, taking pictures but only in the weekend because he's working during the week. Keeping my stories up to date because I'm always posting stories through the day. Filming workouts, that's something I daily do. Responding on emails for collabs because I work as an influencer, which means that you do collaborations with brands and you make a promotion for them. I only do that with brands I really like because I don't sell shit if you know what I mean. So I only do it with brands I really, really love to work with. The other things I do is um, emailing a lot. Most of the work I do is um, responding on private messages on Instagram and creating new content. I think that's like something I really need to do daily, finding some new ideas for new story posts, new building holes for new TikTok videos, because I also do TikTok. That's what the influencer life is. Life without the virus is way different. I travel a lot for photo shoots, uh, so I'm always working when I travel. And of course I go on a vacation twice a year, um, normally one time together with Michal to Poland because he's Polish. Also sometimes with a friend. Still, I can't believe that this year is so weird with the virus and so many things happened this year. Still, I went to Los Angeles in January, which was so amazing. I went to Dominican Republic in February and to England 
So that was super cool. I already did so many cool things this year. I can only say I'm really blessed and lucky. <laughs> I'm done working, I had a busy day. Michal is also home from work and now it's time to go for a run. <laughs> We're back from running, now it's time for dinner. I'm going to eat chicken, some satay sauce, uh, oh. green beans, and some kind of potato wedges and of course i will eat some mayonnaise with the potato wedges and after dinner it's time for ice cream where is my ice cream where is it oh here it's behind the pizza oh wait there's here one over here cornetto it's like a chocolate ice cream we just ate dinner. I really enjoyed it. It was so nice. Um, now it's time to relax and watch Big Bang Theory. Uh, thank you so much, you guys, for watching my vlog. I hope you liked it. And don't forget to subscribe. See you next time.